Antonio celebrating its 300th birthday next year. The story of San Antonio's birth goes all the way to the Canary Islands, just off the coast of Spain. In 1731, 56 brave volunteers from the islands crossed the Atlantic by boat to start our city's first civic government. The island's involvement in starting our city is something they are still very proud of to this day. So today we're making a dish from Pequeño San Antonio Restaurante. That's the little San Antonio restaurant. And Gerardo Carvajal is here with the La Familia Cortez restaurants to share this and celebrate our special connection with the islands. Right. Thanks Three, so much for being 300 here. Years. 300 years. 300 years, three centuries. Excited. That's we're a long excited. time to be around. Yeah. What is your tip to live a long life, Gerardo? Um, Besides the apple a day, the keep the doctor away, all that saints, <laughs> you do I said that? a shot of tequila every day. Shot of tequila, yes. I like it. Just one, though. That's just, oh, yes. Just, just one, all right. After the first bottle, yes. All right, so tell us about your connection with this restaurant. Okay, um, well, I happen to know the, the owner is uh, Nando, which I uh, want to send a, a shout out to him and um, his family. So. He is the one who provides this for us, the okay. recipe and... I think menu. we have some pictures. So, uh, okay. I, do we? Yeah, I don't know. Well, that, that'd be Hopefully great we'll see them. <laughs> okay, we're going we're gonna to start well, let's with... let's get started then. Well, so okay. this is the recipe you got yes. from the island. So what's the yes. first thing we do to start so making it's it? Two pa we have two pounds of pork tips over here. Oh, nice, yeah. We're going we're gonna to put that in here. Okay. If you want. Well, that's a big bag. Uh, what do you get uh, these yes, big bags? Yeah. That's a big bag. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so we're just going to pour That's all that meat. That's the smallest I could find. That's the smallest bag they got. Okay, so right into the bag. There we go. Okay. Okay. Then we, we're going to use uh, four ounces of uh, white wine. Okay. And where's that going? Into the blender. Into the blender. Okay. Okay. So the white so wine goes So here we go. So white there. wine. Yeah. Bam. Four ounces. Two tablespoons of pimenton. This this one right here? Yes. Okay. Round it. There then, we go. And then we have apple cider. Two tablespoons of apple cider. Ooh. Well, that smells good. Five garlic cloves. Five garlic cloves. Oh. And there a partridge in a pear tree? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oregano, a couple of teaspoons of uh, oregano. Oregano, nice. And we, we have time. Do we, we always got time. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you guys were going to do that. Salt, a little, all the salt? Yes, all the I salt. I always have bad salt, luck with that. I always taste. throw in too much. Salt. We're just going to throw all that, all that. Pepper? Pepper. Yes, there and we go. And we had to bring it to San Antonio with... The chipotle pepper. Oh yes, look at that's, that. That's, that's see, see, see the heat, the heat oh, theme. Yes. That that's could be the heat. that could be a, a thing to help you live longer. So, and then mm -hmm. we blend this. Are we going to yes, start blending? Blend that. Okay. All right. And this is gonna, so many good flavors, you oh, know. Oh yes, everything. And we're gonna put that into uh, to the bag. We're gonna okay. let it mar marinate overnight. Okay. And all the flavors really gonna marry and come together. Uh, then we have one here that is... That's already done. Yes, already so is done this a traditional Spanish dish? Yes, okay. uh, especially for the Canary Islands. Uh, they use this dish during uh, festivities, mm -hmm. during Christmas time or celebrations, any kind of celebration. Um, so there we go. Hold on. So now little, we're going to open little, this guy, right? A little, little help? Yeah, little right. help. There we go. Yeah, yeah, there you got those gloves. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Oh, there we go. It's a slippery one. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. Okay, okay so now it's nice and open. Pour this into the... Pan. There we go. Oh, there we go. Nice Pan. and hot. We're gonna, there we go. We're going to cook this for about 45 minutes. Okay. At a low temp. Low temperature, 45 oh minutes. Oh, my gosh. Smell, that smells amazing. And we don't need to add any oil because it's got the oil from the from the uh, marination. So we're going to cover this. Let that this. go on like a medium heat? Yes, okay. medium to low heat. We're okay. going gonna to cover it and let it cook for a good 45 minutes. Okay. Mm -hmm. And... After 45 minutes, this is oh, what we're going to have. That is, oh, that's what it looks like. Look and at that. Oh, my god! Looks and smells delicious. So let's bring this out here. Now, La Familia Cortez is restaurants. They're gonna, you guys are going to be a really big part of the tricentennial. What does that mean to be part of such a special well, event? Well, you know, this next year they, they got the uh, Familia Cortez guys chose to be the Grand Marshal for the uh, yeah. Battle of the Flowers, which is a great honor. Yeah, and, of course, and you know, and it's not just one of them, right? We're getting the whole gang is, is getting right. on there. Everybody is a Grand Marshal for this whole thing. <laughs> right. And that's such, a, that's such a big event. I'm going to try a little bit of this, right? Oh, that's it. I got to try. Oh, hot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. And this so is from the Canary Islands? Canary Islands, yes. This uh, is like a little taste really, of history. It's really an emblematic dish for the Canary Islands. Wow, that is really good. Mm. Mm. Oh, oh, amazing. Oh, oh, oh. Like that is so good. Wow. Now, is Meat DR going to be shut down while you guys are Grand Marshals of... Oh, no. 
Yeah. 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 Yeah.